Geometry, Chapter 1, Lesson 4, and we want to look at parallel figures. Uh, we'll begin with looking at parallel lines, and then uh, we'll also look at skew lines, what that means, and then we'll look at parallel planes, because figures are made up of segments and planes, and so we'll look at what makes them parallel, what makes them skew, and then what's the difference. As we read the paragraph here, it says lines may not intersect, but that doesn't mean that they have to be in the same plane. It says they may or may not be coplanar. And remember, coplanar simply means that they're in the same plane. So if two lines are in the same plane, okay, and they don't intersect, these are what we call parallel lines. So the parallel lines require that the lines be in the same plane, so or on the same flat surface. So if you have a flat surface, you have two lines in that surface, they don't intersect, these would be considered parallel. So quickly uh, writing down our definitions then for this, parallel lines have to be coplanar. Please notice the spelling is coplanar. AR, not coplane er. So take note of the spelling when you're writing your summaries. And parallel lines have to be in the same plane then, and they're lines that don't intersect. So this would be an example of parallel lines. Now, if we're taking a look further, we have other types of lines don't, that don't intersect, and these are called skew lines. Now, the skew lines are not in the same plane. So we talked about before the definition being very important when we're talking about lines or when we're talking about figures and, and explaining why something is or isn't true. Now parallel lines require that they be in the same plane. Skew lines are not in the same plane therefore they can never be parallel even though they don't intersect. And then skew lines do not intersect. So you have two types of lines that cannot intersect. Lines that are in the same plane and lines that are not in the same plane. Lines that are in the same plane and don't intersect are parallel. Lines that are not in the same plane and do not intersect are called skew. Okay, so skew lines are not in the same plane, therefore they cannot be parallel, parallel because they don't meet the requirement of parallel lines. And then they don't intersect, okay? So in our diagram here, if you uh, can see this, A, B, and E, F are both in the same plane. They're in that front face of this figure. So because they're in the same plane but don't intersect, they're parallel. You'll notice, however, A, B and C, G are in different planes. A, B is the plane that's the front of that cube. The line C, G is in the plane that's the side of that cube. So they're not in the same plane. And AB and CG will never intersect. So because they're not in the same plane, they're skew rather than parallel. We can now extend this to what we know about the parts of the lines. In other words, if the lines are parallel, if known to be parallel, then if you take segments of those lines, those segments must also be parallel. Or if you take rays that are parts of those parallel lines, those rays will be parallel. So segments can be parallel, rays can be parallel, and the same thing for skew. Segments can be skew, and then rays can be skew as well. So because rays and segments are parts of line, if the lines that they're a part of are either parallel or uh, skew, then the rays and the segments will also be parallel or skew.